It appears as a convoy arriving at the Dr. Alex Ikweme Square in Oka, but that's not the case. These are 151 vehicles to be distributed to the traditional rulers in Anambra State. Guests gather at the venue to witness it, and the arrival of the state governor, Willie Obiano, signals the commencement of the ceremony. The gesture from Governor Obiano is in recognition of the roles which traditional rulers play in the communities, as well as the need to accord the traditional institutions the dignity and prestige they deserve. From the beginning of his administration, he decided to make the traditional rulers, to make them a bedrock, a foundation of his uh, administration. Governor Obiano commends their efforts in ensuring development at the grassroots while tasking them to maintain peace and security in their domains. My administration has been at the forefront in seeing after the welfare and well-being of our traditional rulers and traditional institutions. Over the years, we ensure that their remuneration and upkeep is well above all the statutory requirements that enables them to perform their duties. It is expected that air-conditioned innocent SUVs, which we are presenting today, will be useful for the royal fathers in coordinating affairs within their domain. I therefore charge them to continue to keep the peace in their various domains and by extension throughout our dear state. After handing over the cars, the Obi of Onicha, His Royal Majesty Nnemeka Achebe, acknowledges the gesture, pledging the support of the traditional rulers to the state government. All the Anambra traditional rulers will support you. We have always been behind you. And going forward, we will continue to support you as you continue in your administration. Apart from the welfare of the traditional rulers, the vehicles which were manufactured in Inewi and Anambra State are also expected to encourage local production in the state.